yeah, yeah. Hello, everybody. Welcome to CCL Season 53 first round match. Oh, we started with a rock between Ice Rain and his Nurgle and Eskiza and his Chaos. Um, in the booth with me is Dimmy G the Champ and Kalon G the Turd. Hello. Marmalade. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> Hello, Jim. <laughs> Oof. Uh, interesting start. Uh, hello, everybody. Hello, welcome to YouTube. Welcome to season 53 of Chalice. Uh, all pretty exciting stuff. Opens with the uh, hit on the wrestler and uh, goes down as well. And then foul appearance on the beast, but uh, re rolls it. These, no, these are no, oh, it was the other guy. It was totally the other deserve guy. each other, by the way. And I'm, I'm thrilled that they're playing each other. Yeah, yep. they deserve each other almost as much as, as the two fucking uh, low TV dwarfs deserve each other. Oh, there goes the beast. Yep. So two two babes for the uh, oh, for the nurgle. Oh, Jesus Christ! Yeah. Because yeah. Uh, okay. obviously the Igor is total shit, right? So they they yes. take two babes. That's one of the few times I take two babes with like an undead team, or a, yeah. well a regen team. So in this case, nurgle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is a really good Chaos team. A really nice Chaos team. It is really nice. It's got loads of cool stuff. Um, it's got some strength up. It's got more strength up. It's got uh, that cool Frenzy Boyo. Um, that squir Squirrel dude didn't like very much, but uh, you like it a lot. And um, yeah, the Nurgle are a bit underwhelming. Um, and they're even more so now, because uh, it started off really well for them, but like, you know, the line of scrimmage was kind of all going a bit shit, and then the beast gets niggled. So, you know, he'll, get, he'll not be too upset about opening with a wrestle hit. Correct. Yeah. Terrible nightmares. <laughs> what? Oh, that's the name, the, of the, it's the name of the team. Yeah, but I was hoping people would just be like, "What was he talking about?" And I wasn't going to explain it at all. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got we've got Dimmy G just saying marmalade for no reason, and Kalon saying terrible nightmares. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe people were having terrible nightmares about marmalade. Maybe. Yeah. What's with I mean, the what's with, what's with the marmalade? <laughs> uh, well, basically, someone said, "What's the best thing to spread?" Oh, and I said marmalade, and then I said it while Jim was closing out a YouTube video. Very good, <laughs> and it came across as somewhat random. <laughs> <laughs> Can't imagine why. <laughs> so, so now it's my new hello and goodbye. <laughs> uh, that's great. Yeah, I mean, We're yes, of course. Goal. Of course, diddle. Butt cheeks were the first thing. See, you know, yes. Zebra said he should have spread the. He should have spread, meaning the LOS. Yes. <laughs> but of course, we all went straight to butt cheeks. Of course. And we're on YouTube, so I can't tell you the difference between jam and marmalade as well, right? I mean. Oh god, prob probably I not. I'd... No, I definitely can't. Okay, yeah, I don't like where it's yeah. going. So. <laughs> so that's cool. Uh, uh, on we go. Uh, so no, no removals this turn from the nur uh, on the Nurgle. So that's pretty good. Uh, just making a good job of getting himself uh, just in front of everything. Um, yep. Kind of doubling stuff up. Uh, nice uh, offense from the chaos so far, keeping everything nice and centralized. So he's able to break down whichever side he wants in a second. Mm. Um, could get more involved in the left, but uh, yeah, I think he's more than likely going to go down on the right. Take well, he, he can get extra hits, right? If he, if he blitzes yeah, this guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, he's not doing it, but what he could have done, he could have blitzed this guy, pushing it there. Yeah, you know, 100%. Right? Yeah. But I guess he would have to foul up here until this way Yeah. Clever man, Jim. I didn't see it either. He went exactly for the blitz I thought I would have gone for, which is the lad out on the side. But uh, this is why you're the Don, right? Exactly. <laughs> this is a little bit dangerous, right, with a dirty player as well. That's another sort of reason you just blitz this guy mm. with, with a warrior. I'd have actually mm -hmm. blitzed this guy with a warrior. And then mm. if you if you foul appearance, you've got a warrior stuff. Yeah, but you're it's still, okay it's still a warrior, right? Yeah, it's still a warrior. Whereas if you you know you don't want to pile on with this dirty player. Who, like who else would have ever come up with the idea of maximizing blocks with chaos? I know, right? Not not as many people as you'd think, Dimmy. <laughs> I can't well, think of one. Go for, for can you? Who comes to the top of ladder quite regularly? Yeah. Mm, he actually doesn't oh, max blocks at all. Interestingly, super interestingly, he doesn't. He's good at finding two Ds, but uh, yeah, he's not great at chaining to get more. No. Oh. Ooh. Oh. He hasn't got block. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> well, that's pretty shite. <laughs> yep. Good old one in eighty ones. Yeah, particularly when you've got a block guy that could have just blitzed anyway. Ah, yeah. uh, Nurgle. 
they're so shit. I'm pretty shit, yeah. It's bad at Blood Bowl. And yet some people absolutely love them and do really well with them. I've, you know, it's, I, I, I kind of see the same thing. Like, when people play Ogres, it's the same thing to me. I'm like, I, I just don't, I just don't get it. I well, I mean, with, with Nurgle, right, there is the hypothetical good Nurgle team. And there is For no sure. hypothetical good, <laughs> good Ogre <laughs> team. <laughs> well, there's, you know, six, roll, six, six uh, rookie Ogres with no rerolls. That's, that's about as good as it gets, right? It is, yeah. Yeah. Can get a nice foul in here on this boy on the frenzy lad as well if he wants to. And yeah, the no DP, I'll, to. I'll be tempted to foul his other DP, DP so yeah. that my cool, uh, cool, my cool. claw pommer can, 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 can pile on unmolested. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's pretty good, isn't it? Mm, I mean, if he's yeah. foul, I don't know how many reserves he's got. Two. Yeah, and he has could a DP, foul, right? He could just foul the claw, mate. He's still. Mm. Yep. Looks like it. It's a good player, isn't it? It is, yeah, and it's a really nice. Yeah, <laughs> kills him as well. Yeah, fucking dead. But regen, yep. oh. regen, massive. Oh, and a send off for it. Hmm. 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 Look, he's gone for the drive. Uh, I mean, he's in a really great position here. The chaos. Uh, I'll come from that one in eighty-one, and maybe a little bit, you know, kind of uh, too spread out. But uh, that one in 81 was really kind of the end of the, the story. This is a GFI. Gets it. Big, nice, big hit in on the uh, Claw Warrior. Ooh. Mighty Blow does the thing. And we do get uh, another Chaos off the pitch. Not going to do a huge amount for um, the numbers on the pitch overall, but, you know, it's, it's something. Mm -hmm. um, I think he can spend some time here just kind of demolishing what's left on the pitch as well, right? Get rid of all of these rotters. Would be pretty sweet, wouldn't it? Yep. Rotters not having regen makes mm. them pretty, uh, pretty great targets. Yep. Do you know what? Do you know what's super interesting? I, uh, I Go googled. I, I didn't Google. I searched my name in a Discord forum, <laughs> as I do sometimes. As you do, yeah. As you do. I, I do that sometimes, and I found a comment from yep. 2020. Okay. Where somebody said. Jimmy thinks chaos will be rubbish in 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 uh, 2020 rules, and then someone's like, oh, oh, "Oh no, they'll actually be easy to win with because they they've got a stream full of strength four and horns and strength actors and mutation actors. They'll they'll carry on doing just fine. Jimmy is you know to only sometimes get things right, and then of course they've got a win rate of 40 percent and they're like third worst team in every single form, second or third worst team in every single format. And turns yep. out Jimmy was right. Who would have thought? Jimmy it? was right. Jimmy was right. Yeah. I think we've got an Elliot clip for that as well, haven't we? Yeah, yeah, we do. Yeah, very Jimmy good. Jimmy being right. Yeah. Was it oh, me saying any of those things? It wasn't, no, no, no. Okay, it wasn't cool. related I to thought, anybody in the booth. I just, fuck I'm you, Jimmy! Fuck it just you, Jimmy! You. I, it just occurred to me because we were watching a Chaos game. Um, yeah. I thought it was... I thought it was... I thought it was going to be a setup because uh, you'd uh, recently joined the Discord. I mean, I'm in, and uh, you're like, actually, you said this in 2020, and I was like, oh fuck, what did I say about Jimmy? No, no, no. <laughs> I've definitely said stuff about you in that Discord. <laughs> like, oh shit. Yeah, I was like, my butt clenched a little bit. I was like, oh no. Oh no. There was yeah. something else which was which was. It was weird because it just wasn't what I said. You know, someone just said something that I hadn't said, and right. that was a bit annoying. But that was, mm. That's not worth talking about. But I, I imagine you get misquoted a lot, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, or just people just don't get what I'm saying, and then the, because yeah, like on my reputation, they decide that. Uh, did, the, uh, did the Discord rhyme with Bebel? No, <laughs> <laughs> no, I um, didn't. It didn't nice. actually. I never get that. that. <laughs> um, there's a there's an interesting thing. something happened recently in one of the other streamers' discords where so it was just after Elliot found out about the um, the being Ooh, able to multiple you, foul with uh, with with um, sneaky gish. You're gonna tell him about the uh, homemade KFC, aren't you? I I am not. Oh, um, oh, yeah, but yeah, Elliot found out about the the thing and then so he tried it once um, yeah. to see if it definitely was a bug and then immediately stopped doing it. Which meant that everybody in chat started giving him the exclamation mark boo and uh, saying that he should definitely be doing it. And he's like, no, I don't want to do it because it's a known bug and it's shitty and I'm winning the game anyway and I don't need to do it and I don't want to be that type of person. Which 
is fine. It's up to him how he decides to play. It's uh, Nobody should tell him whether he's right or wrong. That's a decision that you have to make for yourself. And I think that's all absolutely fine. But cut to me later on that afternoon and somebody was going like, oh, Elliot found out about this thing. So he's just been going around doing this all day. And I was like, like that's specifically not what he did. Mm. Do you know? Like, I don't understand why you'd be giving him a hard time about it either. Or why would you say something like that? So like, someone also had the time of their lives with that bug, didn't they? <laughs> well, that was the other funny thing, was that while somebody was going like, Oh, Elliot did this, there was a video of Jim <laughs> maniacally cackling as he fucking con continued <laughs> to foul. Ah. Yeah. I, was, didn't was, foul I didn't foul a person, though. No, 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 you it didn't. Was the you're, AI. you're filing a Chaos Warrior. Oh, it was, oh, right, okay, it was, it was the, an AI. Yeah. But it was you getting steadily more and more excited. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I loved how, like, it was yeah. hilarious, wasn't it? It was a hilarious book. It was pretty funny. Yeah. But, yeah. Side-eyed, accidentally improving Blood Bowl. Right? Yeah, it was so good. Like, like the fucking, uh, what's it called? The uh, T -T -D -T -D file. Yeah, the TD file was incredible. That was the most fun ever in Blood Bowl. Too. He's managed to like screw this up a bit. So, so, yeah, you know, he I mean, has. I, yeah. I started talking about the chaos thing just because obviously the drive was done. Yeah. Um, that was my not so subtle thing of this drive is finished. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Stop trying Let's to hype up the game. <laughs> but actually, you know, he somehow he didn't throw it really because obviously there was there was still another turn. Like there wasn't there wasn't another turn, so it didn't mm. matter. But somehow all of his players ended up on the ground. <laughs> I don't know how. He did, yeah. He kind of got involved in a bit of a fight that, like, well, he, he wasn't. He was trying to pick off the the guys, but then decided to plug everything in and then lost that fight and then had his his ball handler all the way down the bottom and it was like well do I score now or do I not score now and he was lucky to get one of the stuns which meant that he was able to park a little bit more to the right which meant him uh, it meant he was inaccessible but yeah there he goes he manages to put it in at least is um is ice rain snows all account oh that's very clever mm. are you an informer Dimmy <laughs> a no, boom, no. Boom down. I'm just saying like you know yeah, yeah, but do you see what I did? Because yeah. it's snow. Snow and ice. Yep. Informer. Informer. I got it. I literally uh, said licky bum bum down. Yep, yep. Uh, I don't get Thanks. it. Big bad to take a mess of snow, so I'll send it down the lane. A licky what? bum bum down. <laughs> you don't know it's a song. Informer. Yeah, yeah, a song yeah. called Informer by a guy called Snow. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Informer. That was really hilarious. It was, yes, it, it was, was really, really, really funny. Yeah, yep. yeah. It was if 10 out of 10. I can't it believe was. you did that on purpose, Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> yep. If that you was... too grew up in the 90s, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> 10 out of 10 boomer comedy, that is. Yes, right. <laughs> God. <laughs> See, Steve knows. <laughs> yeah, Steve gets it. Yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, Not many players are there with it. The, this could be a big swing here with like the double LOS. But, um, far for goal. Yeah, it was Astafagor was the last guy and I was like, are these guys named after? Like, is that Astaflix or something? But no. That was my uh, chalice. Qualifying team, wasn't it? Far for go. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I can't remember. I can't remember. That was so good. <laughs> for course. Oh, I can't remember. Yeah, I don't know. There's something there. Uh, really nice uh, line of scrimmage as well. Uh, well done in getting all of the three dice. Uh, you've made everybody here very, very happy. Yep. I think Nick or Shawnee made the team, didn't they? After, after yeah, yeah, Shawnee, Shawnee made it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nick's just the new Shawnee, isn't he? Really, Australian Shawnee. Basically. Oh, Nick on Nick on Elliot stream is the best thing ever. It was really funny. Yeah. It is really good because he did like Elliot looks tiny because it's really weird not knowing what size people are, right? Because when you meet people like because I met Hancock, Hancock's tiny as well, right? <laughs> At least. He's not tiny. He's not like he's like a normal sized human being. Yeah, yeah, he is. He's a normal size. But you're used to kind of seeing him, and he's got the headphones, and he's got the hood up, and he's all like, oh, "Fuck off, yeah, fuckers." 
and <laughs> sorry, <laughs> so bad. <laughs> That's such a bad impersonation. I'm really sorry. Um, but <laughs> you meet him in real life and you're kind of like, oh, he's this kind of quiet little boy. And I gave him a big bear hug and he's like, oh, who's a little boy? It was kind of nice to see him like that. Have you, have uh, you met, have you met is fucking No, I haven't met oh Bros, but I understand he's, he's really <laughs> small, right? Well, then someone said he's five foot nine, which isn't really small at all. Well, no, no but it's just because when you look at him on side. stream, he looks like he looks really long. He looks like, you know, a standard long <laughs> Scandinavian really long. lad. <laughs> How long he does, are he you? looks and he plays like handball and you're like, oh, he's probably like six three. But he's like, you know, yeah. I'm quite good looking, have nice teeth, look at my blonde hair. You know, <laughs> that fucking standard Scandinavian thing. And then I suppose Hargrim's the same. Hargrim is quite small. Yeah. But then everybody was going on about how tiny Hargrim was, and I met Hargrim, and I was like, he's just slight. He's not no, small. No, no, he's tiny, yeah. <laughs> he's... You can't call Hancock tiny and then say Hargrim's slight. Like, well, well, no, it's just because... So the difference is that people were going on about how this guy is absolutely tiny, so I was expecting to meet, like, a hobbit, you know? <laughs> I mean, he's and, not And he's not a hobbit. Uh, he's kind of small, but he's also just kind of... He's just... He's very slight. There's not much to him, you know? Did you meet Hargrim after several beers? I, I mean, I, I've had more than several beers with Hargrim over the course of one weekend. I don't think there was a minute where we weren't drinking. Wait, was you both yeah. flying down? <laughs> <laughs> I quite like Hargrim, for the record. That guy's good. He's, 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 uh, I, I, I enjoy his company quite a lot. This is an interesting strat, wasn't it? Leaving the hole there and then, like... Uh... Try yeah, being able to get the extra. Like yeah, really, really great. Ooh. You can get rid of this guy and get a really nice foul off. And um, yeah, did set himself up for the uh, ice. Uh, or sorry, um, uh, Akaisu did set himself up for the quick snap as well. Um, but this is all really, really nice. And being able to get this lovely foul in here is pretty great. I mean, it does mean giving up the extra hits here, but yeah, it's, uh, it's fun. <laughs> yeah, definitely fun. Hey, I always. All right, right. This is a true actual bit of football criticism here mm. um <clears throat> i don't like being this narrow at this time like i like to have like some zombies out on the wings like because he's he can he's just in a position to get surrounded and completely <clears throat> screwed over here yeah so rather than actually protect the ball uh, i'm going to agree with space cadet here and say that he should have just left the guys out on the wings mm, but then on the other hand then they can like you know the, the wider you are then like the less of a unit you are, isn't it? So, like, there is an argument for keep, keeping everyone together. I, yeah, year, I so. just feel like we're going to see a lot of pressure this next turn because of the the shape that he adopted at the end of that last turn. Yeah. Yeah. I uh, I suppose the, the the guard is definitely going to be able to play a huge influence on the next uh, couple of turns in a way that it wasn't previously. Yeah. Because he has, like, is there any guard on the on the Nurgle? Uh, no. I mean, so, to be fair, he hasn't really punished it as much as I thought that he would. Like, I, yeah. I thought he would collapse around the sides, like, but yeah. I guess he also wants to protect his core bomber and stuff, so... Hmm. Oh, Jackpot. Oh, the Wrestle Tackle Blitz. Devastating. Yeah. Well, Wrestle I mean, is, it is, it is the deadliest player right? in the game, yeah. Yeah. We're all aware of this. I mean, you laugh and this guy's dead now. Well... Oh, so close. <laughs> <laughs> Wrestle, the best kill skill. It is, isn't it? Yeah, I, I always I, forget. Yeah. yeah. Being, I mean, being stunned is so close to death. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Basically the same thing. Yeah, just but for a longer period of time, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you could say like permanent stun. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yes, he was. I guess I'm gonna get called tiny, seeing as I'm five foot eleven. Apparently, if you're not like six foot six, people will just call you tiny forever. You're five foot eleven. Wow. Yeah, you exactly. midget. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. <laughs> I'm only I'm only five eleven as well. No, if if you're five eleven, how are you calling Hancock small? <laughs> like he's just smaller than I was expecting. Is all. Do you mean he's not like twenty five stone? Yeah. No, he's just. I was just expecting, like, because he works for a living and stuff like that as well. You know, oh, so only tall people be... work for a living. <laughs> no, but like, are I was expecting are you him calling to have him a bit small... more mass to him. Are you calling oh, him right. small as in not his height? 
Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what he's saying. He's saying right. he's not as fat as he thought he would be. No, I'm not saying fat. I'm just saying he's. he's oh, not, you're he's saying he's he's pill. smaller than you thought. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, I'm not saying he's oh. like smaller. Than... Oh. Yeah. So like you would have thought he'd, he'd have a big number wing. Yeah. <laughs> he's more like he's more like a he's, he's just a double yeah. donut. <laughs> The, uh, the the docking was entirely in my favor. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> it wasn't so much a docking as an envelopment. <laughs> exactly. So, so what you meant to say is he was a huge disappointment to me. <laughs> I don't know. No, I'd say he was more of a disappointment to the people who tried to go docking with them after the after the UKTC. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is very far forward. I'm not sure Isn't this is it? correct. Yeah. I guess he can chain. He can he can chain, but then it's an uphill to chain. So this is. I think cool. he's just feeling mad pressure. Like this yeah. is the only explanation I've got. You mad I pressure, bro. I, mean, I don't know why he feels. Was... Yeah, yeah, I guess it is. Yeah. And the guard is terrifying. Well, I mean, like, what what is the outcome of scoring? Like, I I don't believe he's going to be in a position to score. At the start of his next turn? No, mm. no, no, this is, and this is bad. even if he does score next turn, what is the outcome of the game? Like, he's yeah. gonna probably lose anyway, so I, I don't personally understand the strategy. I would have probably hung back a little bit. Yeah, blitz through this guy and, and, re, and re centralize and Yeah, just hang back. back. I think mean, you're probably forward. losing anyway, though, right? Like, you lost yeah, he probably is, season. yeah, which yep. is, yeah, yeah. But I just, I, 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 like, this play has two terrible outcomes. You either yep. don't score, or you do score, <laughs> yep. and either way, it's pretty terrible. Yeah, yep. yeah. If he was 1-0 up, then that made more yep. sense, but I still wouldn't yeah. like it. <laughs> and, <laughs> a, and a base sideline case. See where, where the ball goes here as well. Mm, okay. Probably one of the worst things that you can try in Blood Bowl. Yeah, it is, yeah. It's, it's, not, it's not good. It's one of those ones you occasionally see, like, a, a couple of chalices back-to-back. -back. There was eye cages happened a lot a couple of seasons ago as well, which was just weird to see so many people doing it. I mean, eye cages are okay when you run out of players, like, to protect yeah. the ball. Like, when it's the last, like, chance. And if you've got a couple of guarders as well, like, if you're eye cage in between guard, mm -hmm. it's not necessarily terrible, depending on whether the Saka has strip ball, wrestle, tackle, like, all the good For stuff. Sure. All the good stuff. But yeah, I mean, it's, it's always Plan C, isn't it? That's the thing. Yeah. It's like it's like passing. Like people going mad about passing, and I'm like, if you I'm have feeling... passed in a game of Blood Bowl to score, yeah. the drive has not gone as well as you would have hoped. Like, and mm -hmm. that is like so. Then when people pick passing skills, I'm always like, you're planning to fail. Like, <laughs> yeah, sure. It's the same as fend, right? People taking fend on their ball carrier, and I'm like, means what? your ball carrier is getting hit. Yeah, yeah exactly. why is the ball carrier right. getting hit? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, here he is himself. Condolences, Hancock. We saw that you weren't blessed. We, we've heard from Kalon that you're not exactly blessed. <laughs> yeah, Hancock That's was... not what I said! <laughs> <laughs> it's all grand. I do really like that utility ball. Uh, uh, the utility ghost that he's got back there is really cool, isn't it? The guy who picked up the ball. Mm. With the uh, two heads in the frenzy. And yeah, he's uh, alright. The wrestle tackle. You love a rackle goat, don't you, Dim? I would. Oh yeah, Dim. Yeah. Obviously. I mean, it's the best go in the game, honestly. Mm. Ooh, look at this. I, I don't think I would have gone frenzy yeah. on that one though. I would have gone rackle two head. I probably would have gone strip over frenzy, honestly. Oh, didn't even surface on player. Like what a rook move. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Could he have got more? He does have another frenzy guy, doesn't he's, he? He's gonna get three. Uh, Which is he's going right. to get two, isn't he? Three. Oh, no, three, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah pretty, pretty nice. Yeah. Very nice. Really nice. Boop, boop. <laughs> See us after, son. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's pretty nice. Um, because he, he did a best sideline <laughs> cage. Chode. The word Chode didn't come <laughs> I did not once use the word Chode. <laughs> More of a button yeah. mushroom. <laughs> yeah. And then if you if you're as old as me, you'll know that when Kalon met Hancock, there was a button moon. <laughs> <laughs> a what? A button moon. 
<laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> <laughs> There's some peg in reference. It was the best. It was the best show on TV when I was a tiny mm -hmm. child. Mm. Button Moon. Mm. Yeah, Button Moon is a yep. Uh, an old uh, kids show. I've I've actually I only know it through reference. I've never I've never watched it because it was on the English channels. We didn't get them. Oh well, you didn't have TV, so did you? Uh, we did. Yeah, we did. <laughs> oh, we did. Yeah, oh, yeah. Really? We oh, plugged right. it up to. We, we had we had to grow the special potato so that we could plug it into it. Yeah, I was gonna say. They just, I was gonna say. If I didn't know if it was if it was too too hard or not. They just carved potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> said, we had a bit of potato and you carved, you ate into it until there was just a little bit of the back left and then we used to play silhouettes yeah. with, can yeah. with candlelight onto it. That was our <laughs> form of entertainment. Yeah. Oh, I thought, is that too much to <laughs> say? So like I, 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 it. I said it anyway. I'm allowed. I'm allowed. It's fine. <laughs> It depends as well, because we needed the electricity, and it depended if the horse was available. Because, you know, there was only one horse in the town. <laughs> Everyone had a ride. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh right. He sent a wicket. Like, I don't want to read about Button Moon. I want to see it. Come on. Button Moon. Oh, you, could, you could YouTube it, couldn't you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I could, Jim, but I don't want to do that. <laughs> I don't want to do that. I don't want to type, like, I just want to click a link that someone's conveniently posted in chat for me. <laughs> this is really well played by the Chaos, wasn't it? Just yeah. the whole game was just really, really well... Yeah, I mean, I mean there's a different... Put himself there, like, in a bit of the, uh, trouble, but, I mean, genuinely, he just played the game really, really well. The team was better, the, uh, the dice were better, and, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I think there's the, the, the difference in... Because the coaching, coaching is very yeah, 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 yeah. I think that's the fair summary. Of like one. even even not bothering to try to get the second score in, just making sure it was safe as houses, getting all of the surfs with the ball down the back left hand corner. He's like, I'm up one nil. I can just win the game. I, I mean, he, he can guys. absolutely get a second score. Yeah, he can now. Yeah. yeah. But he didn't push it. Is the point, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, it, it's not very well, difficult to score against two Nurgle players, is it? No, no it's not. <laughs> not. Not known for their ball handling. <laughs> Unlike Hancock. Well, <laughs> this is a legal concede, isn't it? Or has he got, he's got um, big keys in there? No, yeah, he's got four. Yeah, he's got four, four, four on the pitch. The surfs and the regens. <laughs> yeah, oh, my God. Doesn't three dice this? That's uh, pretty, pretty shit, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. No offence. Uh, no, Kalon. Gosh, Kalon yeah. has turned into Jimmy when it comes to mentioning three dice. Three dice? No, yeah. just, we're, we're just of a mind. Uh, I, I, I have been a, a long a long proponent of the three dice. Um, I've, been, uh, I've been watching his Irish casts and he goes yeah, I mentioned the three dice every time it's not three dice. <laughs> That's the thing. It, it, started, it turned into a joke where the it turned into a joke where it was the raise the Kalon um, on, a, on a three dice and the, the, my, my logo would come up and you'd be able to see my little tater willy. <laughs> Um, but I, I, so uh, Jim and I are just of a mind. It's just the way we play the game. Like if you can get three dice, you should be taking three dice. What I do is if I can't make it three dice, I just roll a one d. Yeah. <laughs> like, he, he, he even moved the guy there afterwards. Yeah, right? afterwards. Yeah, exactly. And this could have been a three d as well. Oh, that, that's yeah, the best. Yeah. That is the best. Like decline three dice ever is when you put the assist in after afterwards, you've chosen yeah. not to three dice. Like that's. Yeah. That's like <laughs> top quality, like trolling. One of the guys, one of the guys actually did that. He was in the chat while I was talking about his game, and specifically pointed it out that he had yeah. done it that way. That the mummy could have got a three dice, but he put the assist in afterwards just so that I'd get annoyed doing the recast. Oh man, yeah, I'm absolutely all for that kind of trolling. Yeah, this is a pitch, this is a pitch clear as well. Wow. It is a pitch clear, yeah. It is a pitch clear, yeah. He's even going to go score on that guy for a level, is he? Oh no, it's just a bobble box. I imagine getting pitched yeah, in the challenge. It. Wow. Really, really nice. Got feel really, really nice. Or a uh, nice terrain. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Yeah, I mean, his, his team was a lot worse and uh, didn't get the but best when it and... When it rains, it snows. <laughs> well, hey! What, are you in Hastings? <laughs> Come on, I strain! Oh, I know, man. yeah, you're, it was good. It was good. Well Hilarious done. banter. Yeah. Yep. Hilarious oh. banter from Dimmy G. Um, right, congratulations to Eskiza. Commiserations to Ice Rain. Thank you very much. Dimmy G and Kalon, glorious having you guys in the booth. 
<laughs> Marmalade. Thanks for, thanks for having us. Yeah. <laughs> thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.